Well, this is a Fox News alert. We have major breaking news on the left wing group ACORN. That's the Association of Community Organizations for Reform Now. This is some shocking and disturbing video just coming out this morning. It is undercover video from an ACORN office in Baltimore, Maryland. Eric Sean joins us live in our New York City newsroom to explain what you are seeing and what its significance is. Eric, good morning. Good morning, Megan. ACORN workers caught on camera telling a supposed prostitute to hide her occupation on taxes, classify underage girls who could be working as prostitutes as dependents, and willing to arrange an ACORN housing loan for a house that could be used as a brothel. And, oh yes, please join ACORN for 120 bucks. Those are the astounding claims from an investigative filmmaker who went undercover to expose ACORN. The filmmaker is 25-year-old James O'Keefe. He pretended he was a law student and went to the ACORN office in Baltimore with his 20-year-old female associate you see there on the right, who they pretended was a prostitute. They claimed they wanted to get an ACORN loan to buy a house for their business because banks had turned them down. On the video, one ACORN tax specialist says the woman's occupation should be classified as a performance artist for tax reasons. Here is some of what she yeah, said. Are, are they from Acorn as well? The type of business or service you provide, let me make sure there's a code for it, okay? A code for prostitution? Well, yeah, because we, we have to ha I have to have a name and a code number. Well, I don't know if there's going to be a code. But I'm going to look in there. I'm going to get my list. Okay. She's going to tell say she's the business. And then we can get the right tax code. Yes. So that's wonderful. Your business is a performing artist. A performing artist? But you are. Okay, so okay. you're not lying. That's kind of we'll play on my word. ego. But you're a performing <laughs> artist. Yeah. Right. Okay? okay, so stop saying busted. Got it. And O'Keefe okay, Fossil said there were 13 underage girls who were going to be illegally imported from El Salvador to, quote, turn tricks. On the tape, the Acorn workers told O'Keefe the girls should be classified on the tax form as dependents or exchange students. And they were told while prostitution is illegal in Maryland, they should make sure the girls go to school. O'Keefe says he's stunned at what he found. I was prepared to have them call the police, uh, throw me out of the office, just be completely hostile to this, and they, without hesitation, uh, helped me in every way they could with, with evading taxes, with, with setting me up with a brothel, with getting around federal tax laws, um, doing everything they can to help us. I was completely shocked. Well, Acorn has some harsh words for the tape. A spokesman's telling us, quote, the portrayal is false and defamatory in an attempt at gotcha journalism. The film crew tried to pull this sham at other offices and failed. Acorn wants to see the full video before commenting further. The tax forms, by the way, were never completed or filed, and the filmmakers say they did not join Acorn or pay the tax preparation fee. One of the workers advised them to be quiet about their business. She said, loose lips sink ships. If you want to 